My name is Raina Merchant, and this is about automated external defibrillators. About a year and a half ago, we launched the My Heart Map Challenge. It's an online contest to engage the public to help us find AEDs, or automated external defibrillators, throughout the city of Philadelphia using their phone and their online social network. Through this process, we were able to find more than 1,400 of these devices all around the entire city. We also learned through this process that sometimes these devices are very hard to find, and particularly when they're most needed. So this year, we're launching the Defibrillator Design Challenge. It's an online contest that seeks to engage the public to find the best way to make AEDs more visible and more noticeable. Our logo for the Defibrillator Design Challenge is to be a hero. We want to empower the public to use AEDs when they see them. Through this contest, we want to make these devices more memorable and more noticeable so that when you walk by them, you can't help but look at them. This project is at the intersection of public health and public art and seeks to engage the public to help take on a really important public health challenge. We wanted people to think about interesting ways to create artwork and designs around the space of an AED that could either be in two dimensions and three dimensions that might encompass um, space that extends outside of where the AED sits, but something that would make it so that people would pause when they would walk by and sort of take another look at the defibrillator and hopefully imprint and remember where it was. To the best of our knowledge, this is the first time that there's ever been a defibrillator design challenge to really try to engage the public um, to think about these devices, to learn more about them, and to feel more empowered to use them. There are lots of different ways that people can participate in the design challenge. We're allowing people to vote using Facebook and Twitter, and they can win up to $1,000. They can also um, win through an expert panel prize, where we're having others um, from design, architecture, business, medicine, look at these designs and decide what they think might really resonate with the public. So we encourage everyone to participate. We're hoping through this project to engage people and reward them, not only with money prizes, but also recognize those who are able to think about ways to make public health more salient. We intend to promote artists and hopefully connect them with other local businesses to create different and exciting installations and buildings throughout the city of Philadelphia. This project is a partnership and we're really looking for designers and people who don't usually work with those in medicine to help us come up with different ways of thinking about this challenging problem.